Okay, this is very far-fetched that it's gonna happen, but I highly doubt this video is ever gonna see the light of day, but if it is, it's good news. Guys, I think, I think this is ITV. Oh my God. Yeah. Um, we're really happy with how everything's gone. Um, and we'd love to fly you out. I'm going into Casa Amor and I'm going to be on Love Island. <laughs> did I just prank you? Because if I did, I'm doing my job right. Hi girlfriends, welcome back to my channel. So you are probably thinking what you're going to love island i'm literally here to shut that down <laughs> straight away no i'm not going to love island this is just all a prank okay basically i've been wanting to do this prank for a while but i've just needed to like find the right time and make it believable and i was just trying to like suss out the best way to go about it so i think i've managed to form a good old prank and i think they're gonna believe it like if they don't believe it i'll be more surprised because baby girl has gone through hoops to get here basically i've been filming little clips here and there which i will insert as well yeah basically i'm gonna sit my sister's down tomorrow and i'm gonna say i've got something to tell you watch this video it's gonna reveal everything and yeah and then i'm gonna record the reactions i'm just gonna say i'm recording the reactions because it's for a video which isn't weird because if i if this was real i would definitely be filming it like it would be filmed if i was going on love island i would film everyone's reactions and then once i was like in the villa or after i come out the villa best believe there'll be videos of like reactions my sister's react to me going on love island like you know all that good stuff so i feel like it's not a weird thing for me to do i'll play you guys the video and then show you their reactions alongside and um, with like a little screen if that makes sense i'm hoping it's gonna go well i mean my sisters aren't stupid and i have actually been approached for love island before i've never said this online or anything because i don't want to be one of those people that's like i've been approached before but i actually was approached before and i turned it down just because i got approached doesn't mean i was definitely gonna be on the show but it's just something that i personally don't think is for me i don't know if it is sort of my sort of thing but i love watching it don't get me wrong but personally for me i just turned it down because you can come out to so much like bad stuff and things like that and i just think i don't really want to put myself in the limelight i don't really want to be famous you guys watching might be like what you're literally like doing youtube tiktok all that but like that sort of fame i wouldn't even call it fame like it's literally like i can still go to the shops i can still go with my friends i can still live a normal life and obviously like yeah it's a good little career on the side and it is like i love doing it but it's not something where i can't leave my house without being packed not saying that if i went in love island i would be like molly may or like one of the islanders that would be packed but it could potentially happen like you don't know who's going to be that sort of person but i'm not saying it would be me but like i just wouldn't want i don't want it to get to that if that makes sense but at the time of my time in my life that i was approached this was january 2020 two yeah so a year ago literally like just over a year ago and um, my manager sat me down and I'm like oh would you do tv love island have come in for you and i was like oh my god what the hell like i never expected to have that conversation in the first place like, i didn't expect it i was actually seeing somebody at the time as well so like obviously i was like seeing somebody and i was just like it's just not for me but the fact that i was seeing somebody at the time makes it easier i think personally because now i can like say the main reason i said no to the girls like if they're like but you turn it down last year i could be like well we'll see in bleep at the time like i didn't want to ruin that obviously me and bleep are not together anymore at that time there was like a few factors this time i don't have uni anymore to worry about i don't actually have a job permanent job right now and apart from obviously social media and like editing and stuff yeah they're gonna believe me more now than like ever so i think now is the right time everyone pray for me i'm filming this clip before so this is currently saturday 28 i think it's gonna be a fun video so i hope you guys enjoy acting skills gonna have to come out to play i'm not a very good actress but you know when i was younger i used to always want to be an actress even though i never did act in my life so maybe now's my time to shine <laughs> and prove that i could have been an actress and no, i'm joking i hope they fall for it if they don't is what it is just i'm just not very good at acting or i've just not pulled it off very well but my friend actually is the voice at the other side of the phone they've not actually well robin has met her but she's not spoke to her for a long period of time so i'm hoping she's not going to guess the voice i'll be like that sounds like maddie but i don't know we'll see hopefully everything will be fine thanks to maddie also for helping me with this video thank you for helping me pull off this little prank okay so i just need to show you something I'm really confused. You like, just gotta watch, okay? Okay. Are you with me with this? I just don't know what this is. I'm just trying to film some content. And She's got a boyfriend and we're about to find out. <laughs> Ready? Mm. Okay. This is very far fetched that it's gonna happen, but 
I got back from Dubai the other day and my manager wanted to speak to me quite soon after. So I've just come off with just come off with, just come off of a call with them and they are fast tracking my application for my finance. I don't know how to feel. No, you're lying. This, this is a joke, this is the time. So slow. <laughs> but the fact that I even applied and like No, like, this is the prank. Like, things, so I thought I'd document this. Just in case. <laughs> just in case. Also, no, I'm not listening. Do you guys like it? <laughs> no, I don't believe it. Well, there you go. I really doubt this video is ever going to see the light of day, but if it is, it's good news. Um, basically, I got approached for Love Island last year um, to go on last season, and I turned it down. And then I got approached again in November time. No, this is a joke. I don't believe it. I was it. a late applicant because I didn't really. I literally just dismissed it at first, and then. The more time went on, I was like, why don't I just do it like a year ago? So I applied yeah. and I was like, just probably working out anyway. so much. I applied. Um, <laughs> I, I skipped round one because I got scouted, so like that's just how it works. And then went straight to round two, which was like an online call with somebody that works at ITV and you just really got an email. Meet into people. Into I mean, you. just got a call online. saying that I have been Not successful in round two. So, I'm going to round three. Literally cannot believe it, but... I still don't, I don't think I believe this. I think it's a prank. <laughs> I mean, I really don't want to get on there. But, you never know. That's why I'm making this right now. Just to remember for myself. But yeah. I think next round, I I've got you. to do a medical test. And a meeting in person. Um, so she she said she'd yeah. get back to me with dates. You're playing her. But, yeah. It's Wait really for it. I can't believe it. Because I think, I think this is something. Oh my god. Hello? Hello, is this Georgia? Yeah, it is. Mm -hmm. Hi, it's Daisy from ITV. Is now a good time to speak? Hi, Daisy. Yeah, it's fine. I'm just sitting at home. I'm alone as well. Oh. Oh my god, really? No, you're lying. Yeah, yeah that's fine with me. <laughs> Sounds really good. Oh my god, this is exciting. So excited. Oh my god. Like, will you have a, um, do you have a job or anything that you'd have to get let know? Or? Um, not no, at the minute, no. <laughs> yeah, but it's all okay, good, yeah. Thank you. So just to keep you um, sort of in the loop, it's looking like you're going to be going to Casa and more. Okay. Um, I mean, I think that's better seeing as then you can have like a, a chance no. to get to know all of the boys and the girls there. Yeah, true. <laughs> That's true, actually. Um, okay, perfect. So, what we're going to do is um, you'll be putting on first. Tara. Um, while we get ready to sort of put you into the villa. Um, and just. Just come off. Just come off. Just went off. And I was like, hello? Oh no, it got off. I think I'm going to close my phone. No. Oh, I'm just going Hello? Hello, I can hear you now. I'm really sorry, I, I think um, that was my, my line cut off a little bit. Um, South Africa. So just to, yeah, just, I was just saying, um, no, just try and keep okay. it very, very quiet that you're going into the villa because obviously we don't want many people knowing yeah. uh, who you are before. And also, um, it's new to our social media this time that you'll have to put in your bio yeah, we'll that you're going to the villa. Yeah, we'll put in your bio, then I'll have to see you soon. Um, like, see you soon. I'd like that when you're on the phone to my account. Um, No, that's all good. Thank you so much for letting me know. That's fine. Right, I'll send you over an email um, just to sort of confirm everything and get everything sorted. But mm -hmm. I bet it's time for you to start packing. <laughs> yeah, definitely. <laughs> Thank you so much for letting me know. That's fine. And mm -hmm. I'll speak to you soon. If you have mm -hmm. any questions, so, uh, this oh, is just message me, okay? Yeah, I will do. Thank you so much. Alright then, see you later. Thanks, bye. Wait, you're not, you're not going to Portugal, are you? <gasps> oh my god. You're not going to Portugal? Cancel it. Oh, oh, I'm coming on like... next week, what the hell? Oh my mum's just texted me. Oh my god, oh my god. Mum knows, dad doesn't. Oh my god! <laughs> That's
Kill you. No, this is a joke. I don't believe it's not. it. You're going for more. <laughs> that was a job application. I'm going to more. No, you're not. Is this what you've been working on? Yeah, 100%. No, well, I'm just working out here because it's January, but I didn't actually think I was kind of oh going God. in. I just thought, oh, I don't know what I'm doing with my life. Might as well. You're lying. I'm literally sweating. I'm so hot. No, I can't. <laughs> Why are you not sure? <laughs> Why are you crying? This is a lie. This is a joke. It's not. It's my period. What, when are you actually flying out? When do you I don't know, they haven't sent an email yet, but I think it's going to be next week. Well, she said next she week. She said next week. So I'm presuming, I think Hassel will be the week after. Who are you going to go for? But I think they're going to go for. <laughs> Wait, can you go in and tell Ron that he's a. and tell Lana to stay away from him? Yeah. Well, I'm not going to see him. Well, unless she might. She, get she might be kicked. Well, I doubt she'll be kicked up. Ron will probably be kicked up. If you stand by the fire pit and have the all. <laughs> no, but please don't go for someone's man because I can't. That gives me so much anxiety. <laughs> I'm no. Sorry. I can't do Cassa anymore anyway. That's, I always said, I'm not, I won't do Cassa. I'm too scared to. You're doing this. Yeah, but I don't have a choice now. You see, for that or nothing. So what am I meant to do? You have to do it. So were these in these interviews are all fake. Some of them are real. Some of them are fake. Because obviously I can't just stop over my whole life in case because it might not happen. No. So, so the two interviews you went to on the day you come to work was real. No. No, they were real. They were real. Yeah. No, you're lying. That's what I, I still don't believe it. Though, but they are. can change their mind up to the day before because they did. They flew Leah. Leah out and then they didn't let her in. So when they're like, you got holiday booked from that. Um, no. Did I cancel Paris? <laughs> why? I was thinking, why are you being like that? Why did you cancel Paris? My job, we went to which be going to week last my birthday. But she was willing to book Paris, and I thought, if I can't get my money back, like, if we book that and it's non like, I can't cancel it, then and I go, I'm screwed. Mum might, but Dad doesn't. What's mum? What did Mum say? Hang mom, on. Mum just said, do what you want to do. Next week. Wait, so you can't come for Paris meal. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know what day. We need a glow up. Like we need to get you. <laughs> no, like we need to get you looking. Fit. Kendra, I know you don't like sunbeds. You should go on a couple of sunbeds. Yeah. You get a better tan. Oh my god, you got to wear Ellie, Ellie has a really though. good idea. I'm not wearing it. Intense. Intense. <laughs> Ellie has a really good intense um, thing for sunbeds. If you want. Uh, she was sweating. I don't even know what. Are you lying? <laughs> no. Are you like hundred percent? You want to go or not? I want to see Dan's reaction. Dan's here. Finn, can we see? <laughs> I'm not meant to tell anyone, though, things. I won't tell family. I haven't even told any. Uh, Tara doesn't even know yet. I'm going to let her down on a Portugal trip and everything. And Manchester, potentially. You are allowed to tell a couple of people. Yeah, George, you are allowed to tell and those friends. Everyone tells you just got to get her to swear to secrecy that she won't tell anyone. But then, as soon as if I got told something, I'd want to tell you. So, like, yeah, if you got, got told that Tara was like, going in, you'd be like, girls, yeah, I'd Tara's telling love island. Yeah. But we wouldn't say anything, so hopefully they wouldn't say anything. I'm not meant to tell anybody. No, Zara didn't even tell her best Who's friend. Who's Zara? The one that just come out. No, John Penny's going to be so shocked. She watches it religiously every single time. No, 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 no,
I'm like, how are you going to tell me, Dad? You know what? No, no, I'm being serious. I've been planning this for so long, and in my head, I've actually been going like, <laughs> is what, that a This obviously yourself? isn't real because I'm. I know I'm about <laughs> to. I'm just going. You've got to go have, have a go. Just, I'm going. You've got to get on the sunbed, girl. When I, was, when I was on the phone, to, when I was on the phone to Maddie, I was actually shaking because I was like, it feels real, but it's not. <laughs> So it's not real. It's not. Oh, we've just been pranked by the privacy drama. <laughs> was that good? I was buzzing as well. I was like, oh my these, god. These videos. I'm going, who are you going to go for? Go for Katie because it's the easy option. These videos before, but this was literally filmed like last week. This one was filmed. I'm convinced that she's just going to pop up on TV next week. I'm going, oh, you can't go to Portugal. <laughs> Oh, oh, that was well I was well buzzing. Well, this is like crying. I'm like, oh you were telling me not to do it last time. I said you should do it. Yeah, she did. You no, said I, I just, if someone starts <laughs> hating me on Twitter, do you not think I'm going to beef them? <laughs> I'm sorry, guys. It was like, <sighs> it I thought it was dead serious. No, this is Monday's video, babe. This ain't nothing to do with <laughs> But it, seems, man quick. it seems, well it's four weeks in, so it would be about next week or the week after. Are they doing eight way. weeks this year or not? I think so. But I reckon they'll push it back anyway because it's no one's in a couple yet really, are we? Success! Let's go! Did I prank no. you? No, no, yeah you did. But no! I'll just stop filming my own content to come and sit here and be pranked. <laughs> that was actually brilliant, wasn't it? <laughs> was it good? Yeah, that was you set that up really well, can't lie. Thank you. You've really put Maddie, a lot. Maddie was pretty good on the phone, wasn't she? I spoke to her the other day, but not not. For we long. were planning it before that, so I was like, I'm really annoyed you've met her because she's gonna know your voice, but you didn't. That was my friend on the phone, by the way, guys. So you've been pranking us. I'm just, I'm thinking. Prank, okay, bad Maddie's ringing you control. now. I'm thinking you're going out for dinner with her. You've got to tell her, surely. You've got to tell her that you're going on it tonight. Mm. Mm. Not funny. Thanks for not being cool. part of this, Robin. Oh, well, Mum knows I'm pranking you, by the way. So if you rang Mum, she would have known. Because she would have gone along with it because she knows I'm pranking you. Mm. She's known since she left. I've been planning it for ages. You should have put Dad in this as well. Shall I ring him? I have no idea what was going on. I have absolutely no idea. You've got to turn this sound up, Danny. Yeah. Hello. Hello. Is your job? There he is. He's a Shut up. What is it? What is it? Listen! It's not Love Island, is it? <laughs> Swear! Shut up! <laughs> Shut up! No way! No, oh surely my not. God. Is she bantering? No she way! When did you go? Shut up! <laughs> oh my days, no <laughs> way! So is it. Man could be a national treasure. <laughs> <laughs> like, 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 be like next two weeks, bro. No. When did you go? Um, Shut up. What the? Oh my. Oh. Like, so we have to work the week after, but I don't know. I don't mind just you know what I'm saying. Oh. Who are you going for? Who are you going for? Who are you going for? I uh, know, I don't watch it. George watches it though. To be fair, you want to just try to stay in. Oh, my, no. Oh, yeah, I've never play, known someone. Play, that again. play that again, play the video again, play it. No way. <laughs> this is not no, no. Hey, this is not Surely nervous. Who's the friend that you want to play with? You're joking. Sorry. Oh, I've never even known someone to be on Love Island. <laughs> I thought you were doing it. No. No, no, no. You've got me. Okay, that was a successful prank. Yeah, I mean, they fully believed it. I'm going, how are you going to tell Nan? How are you going to tell Dad? <gasps> She's like, who knows? knows? I'm like, it's not real. I'm like, I've got to George is going to be so shocked when he sees you on the TV. <laughs> <laughs> no, you were fully convinced I was, you have to have a bikini on TV. <laughs> I'm going, like, I know he's going to have some Go for Casey. But, <laughs> yeah, you go with that. Basically, on pal. Anyway, that um, is all for this video. Hope you guys enjoyed this. This is like my first ever prank, I think. Have I ever done a prank before? No. I don't think I I've ever done a prank, so this was a good start. I don't think it was perfect, like, timing. Have you been thinking about this for ages? <laughs> Quite a while, yeah. I hate you. Literally, like, over a month now. But yeah, hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, I want to see more pranks. Let me know what you want to see down below or DM me so then everybody else can't see what you're telling me to do. Um, I think I pulled it off really well. So, I'm not going to Love Island, but Love Island. Maybe next time. <laughs> Bye.